really have faith in what you're doing. Cause soon as something pop up, it's gonna look like the end all. But if you got a game plan of everything you need to do, you know, one thing pop up, well I still gotta do this, 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 and that, so all this ain't gonna stop me. You know what I'm saying? Another thing pop up, well shit, I accomplished this two things, I just my last obstacle, I only got three more things to do, let me keep pushing, fuck it. Pretty soon you see you, you attain your goal. And then you create another one. But without a game plan, without a, a strong sense of faith in what you're doing, real hard to accomplish anything. You know, it's a lot of obstacles out here. Family, baby mamas, you know, your homeboys being involved in a, in, in a crab in the bucket syndrome. Shout out to the homie uh, Lamar from some sex entertainment, television and films, man. Keep up the good work. Man, we live out here in LA, man. At this Dipsy Hustle funeral, man. What's your name, bro? Mark. Mark? Mark Anthony. Where you from? From uh, Crenshaw and Slauson area. Grew up with Nick. That's what's happening, man. So this uh, got to be a, a touchy situation for you, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Yes, Same place where he died. Same place where he died. Where I met that nigga at. I used to kick it every day before he even, even all this was was thought of. Same same spot where he dropped at. Man, but, how long you been knowing it? Been knowing him since... What, like 05, 06 summer? Damn, when I was bro. going to college and coming back every summer, we used to kick it at the same spot where you end up buying. Damn. Every day, all day. Damn, bro. So, yeah, man, I know they was fucking with him real heavy in the hood, huh? Oh, yeah. He was doing he was doing a lot, man. He was doing stuff that niggas didn't think about doing with their money. Normally, when niggas first start making money, they spin it up. That's right. And they get themselves in debt. Yeah. He was, he was flipping his money. Just like, just like he was making street money, he was flipping his legit money there into more legit uh, investments. Right. And putting his boys on and, and changing their mindset. You That's know what right. I'm saying? So That's right. What they did, what that, that, that little nigga did was just, just you know, he just like stopped the whole bus right now. You know what I'm saying? Slowed it down, but it ain't, you know, they gonna keep it going. Marathon continue. They keep it going. It's, yep. It ain't gonna die. That's right. Because niggas is coming together. Yeah. Niggas is already coming together. Niggas is already locked in from all different hoods, so it ain't gonna stop. There you go. Once niggas' mindset has changed, once niggas see see their own niggas, you know, doing different things and making things becoming successful and coming together, yeah. it ain't gonna stop. That's right. You know That's right. But us and all the OG niggas need to need to get into these young niggas' heads because they don't care. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They 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 just out there aimless. That's right. So the older heads need to get in their head and show them what to do with their money and their time. You know there what I'm go. saying? Instead of just wasting. That's right. They That's gotta right. Do. Okay, yeah. bro. Well, man, I appreciate it, man. All day.